guitar guide helping you find your sound. Today I've got a great song by Lindsay L. called Waiting On You. Speaking of waiting, if you check the channel out and you like what you see, what are you waiting for? Subscribe. Now hit that bell icon so you'll be notified every time I upload a video for more guitar tips and tricks. Alright, on this uh, video I'm going to do a couple of short lessons and as you can tell it's um, bar chords but I'm going to show you how to do it using a capo and um, we'll have a video on that for a beginner and then we'll go over the bar chords and then I'll do a video on connecting all the chords together. It's going to be fun. Alright, so in this video I'll show you the chords and um, we'll show you how to play it the easy way. So the chords are a G sharp, and then an A sharp, and then a C sharp. So if you don't want to start out with the bar chords, you're a beginner, but you still want to play this great song by Lindsay E. Got a trusty capo. And um, if you don't have one of these, check out the selection we've got over at yourguitarguide.com. So, you're going to put the capo on the first fret. Alright, so we've got the capo on the first fret. And we're going to play G. An A. And a C. And so, because the capo is on the first fret, it's really a G sharp, an A sharp, and the C sharp. So, to make the G, you can make it like this. But I do it like this here. Either way is correct. Whichever is easiest for you. So, our third finger will be on the uh, third fret. Third fret from the capo. So the capo is acting like the nut. Sixth string, third fret with your third finger. Your fifth string, second fret will be your middle finger. And then put your pinky on the first string. And then we've got the A. All of our three fingers are going to be on the second uh, fret and A string. The first finger will be on the fourth string, second fret. Second finger is on the uh, third string, second fret. And third finger, second string, and the uh, second fret. Then we've got the C, third finger will be on 5th string, 3rd fret, 2nd finger, 4th string, 2nd fret, 1st finger, 2nd string, 1st fret, that's the C. So the rhythm on this song is So in this video we're not going to worry about Connecting all the chords. Well, I'll have another video on that. So right now, just concentrate on hit the sixth string, strum from five, four, three, two, one. Then it goes to the A. Open A string, fifth string. Then 
to the sea. Back to G. So if you have any problem um, with basic chords, check out First Position Chords over at YourGuitarGuide.com. Everything you need to start playing songs and show you exactly where to put your fingers and what to strum. Okay, the tempo picks up on the uh, second verse and it's... doing the same thing but instead of picking the root note uh, one time you pick it twice so pick it twice strum and then pick it once that would be the sixth string and then strum and then do the A chord, which is the open A string, fifth string, tap it twice, strum, on the C, we're going to pick the C, fifth string, third fret, Strum, pick it again one time, back to G. Use this part of your hand right here to mute the notes. Stay tuned because I'm going to show you how to play like Lindsay L does with the bar chords and then we'll have a video on connect the chords. Uh, you might notice I was playing this on this little um, Yamaha the Pacifica and I picked this up to do a review on it and um, I actually have a post over at uh, the Guitar Essential blog so check that out and I uh, I'm going to do a review on this guitar. If you like the way it sounds, check the link below and um, you'll get all the information on it. If you like this video, can you give me a thumbs up and uh, share it? Thanks.